Okay, welcome back, Kansas. June 3rd, okay? No, sorry. Third week of June, 2021. What happened astrologically June 3rd is what I just got pulled to. Did something happen astrologically June 3rd, 2021? It says, now time to tackle. Ooh, what did I hit? June 3rd. Maybe something going up on with your Western and Vedic, too. It was Thursday. It was the 154th day of the sixth month. The Zodiac was in Gemini, so you might want to watch Gemini. Um, so you might have been tackling some difficult things. It could be, really, Kessel, all, if your life path number was a five, something must have started. But again, it's like, the moon had to abandon in Gemini. Astrologically, that was like the strongest sign on that day. Venus star point Gemini. Sun, Venus conjunct, Venus star point. See, something was telling me about Venus too, but it wanted me to do Mars. So you could be dealing with somebody who has a Gemini Venus. All right, Cancer, week three. We have the Hermit. This almost reminds me of, really, the Magician too. So you could be down with the Virgo, cancer, cancer. But to me, this is like, you're also creating something here. Seven of Wands. You blocked something or you're going to block something. You Something, you're being quiet. You block somebody. Or you're not talking to them yet. Or you're not telling somebody something. You're standing strong. Could be down with the Knight of Pentacles. If you're not pissed off, you might. This might happen during this week. You, you're gonna go quiet, and to me, you're not going within. Like, I feel like something. Like you turn your back to like a Virgo or a Sag or a Scorpio. That remind me of like a pumpkin. What is this? Queen of Swords, yeah. It was reversed. I don't read these reversed, but yeah. You're pissed off this week. Um, and others of you, if you're not pissed, you're, you're very practical, mental. You're not letting anything get in your way. You're standing your ground. You, like, it's like you're zipped. You could have even possibly have blocked somebody. Like someone's getting a dose of you, all right. Let's see what's going on with the other other person or the other situation. Mute. What are you both mute right now? 
or this is or this is your side divine timing and abandons so something's going down the way it's supposed to or the inter or the universe is intervening You're quiet. They're quiet. I'm telling you, some of you are over here. I don't know if someone played games and it's like they're dealing with a situation that needs to be blocked. Because I felt quiet. I, I, it feels like some of you, this is you and you left a situation and somebody's missing you. Yeah, somebody needs to purge a situation. So someone's being someone's like not telling you something, but the the universe is intervening. Okay? So some of you might be pissed about something or you literally blocked someone. So this could be you need to focus on Money, no, abandonment, comic partner. So this is the other energy. It's like you need patience or they need patience. So whoever is see bounce. So this is the karmic situation. It's like they need to purge. There's two focused on material things. Or this is the empress that came into play. Okay. Um, have patience on yourself or have a little patience. There is There is something going down. So, majority of you, this is you. This was in the collective read. This is what this is. And right now, to me, you, you're you're probably manifesting what you want. It's like you, no. See, I, I feel like there's something here. Like you weren't having it. You're not having a certain situation. Yeah, see, nine of pence, ten of pence. It's something that is going on around you. And you, you had enough. Others of you, you're manifesting. Again, quiet, secret, something with money. So to me, you knew something was going on. Queen of Cups. Yeah, you blocked a situation. You weren't happy. Or you're about to block a situation. Again, your back is turned. Okay. This isn't you don't have a blockage. You're about to block somebody, or you're about to stand real freaking tall and, and tell somebody exactly what's on your mind. So just know that divine is at play here. And you got the world. Yeah, you ended something. But this is also a congratulations. Because you're starting something new. You ended a cycle. Welcome in the moon, meeting the one, opening your heart, getting together, perfect timing. You ended a cycle and another one's going to start. You could be dating somebody new, getting back out there. That's what's on your mind. So you definitely blocked a situation. Or you're about to. Mentally, emotionally. 
and then I like you. Someone likes you, romance is flirting, flirting, starting to dance, abundance, or starting to date. You're going to start dating again. Some of you, this, this energy is going to roll back around, so completely up to you. Others of you, you're just going to start doing your own thing. You're confident, you're feeling it, you're strong. You ended some type of long-ass cycle that did not work for you. Okay. And then over here, you literally have the universe stepping in. Okay. And it, it, it's like someone was real quiet with you about how something was going down. There might be some material things, money situations going on with them, especially if there was a marriage. But have patience because it's like there's a karmic situation that is definitely wrapping. But to me, I think you did the right thing by ending something. Because you, it is, something was, was too much. You're going within. You know what you want. You're confident. You're strong. You want the golden ticket. You know? You, you block something. Or you're standing up and very strong in your beliefs. But to me, it looks like you block something or you're getting past the blockage. It's, you manifested something you want. Because you know what you want. You did your, you did the inner work. You won't settle. Good job. Over here, just know that the divine is, is working on it, okay? I hope you guys have a kick-ass week. And if you're going to start dating, have fun. You're about to, to meet somebody. Or you just started dating this person. You're opening your heart again. You might meet somebody this week. Could even be at work. Could bump in somebody at the at the grocery store for all I know. But you got happiness. Happiness coming. I don't know why it's telling me to do this. Yeah, look at that. Best advice. Again, Queen of Swords. Objective decision, decision making. Clearing away what no longer serves you. Seeing the humor in a situation. Well, I don't think you see the humor in a situation, but to me, you're not. You're not dealing with it though you know what I mean you're just like done independent experienced realistic witty clearing away when no longer serves you good job because you know what's best for you okay and then you got them over here Yeah, you got the lovers on the four of pens. Being too frivolous, too cautious with money. There's something going on with money over here. And then the lovers, intimate relationships, carefully weighing up their decision. You know, the universe got something over here. And it's with the queen of water. It's with you. Relationships develop to a new level. Trust your intuition. Care for yourself and others. So, if you ask me, yeah, you're not having it, but some of you might want it to come back around. If not, don't worry. You got you got new energy coming your way. I love you guys.